How's it going guys? Welcome back to another video. Today I have the Hatsune Miku Cheerful Japan version. Here's the box. Pretty cool box. Here's some artwork on the side. But yeah, that's just the box. Let's get right into the figure. Alright, so here we have the base. We got the yellow and brown finish on the on the speaker and then the speaker itself it's grayish kind of blue looking color looks pretty good it's it is really light base the painting's nice and glossy and the outside comes with this metal rod it's supposed to go in like that now here's the figure you know really awesome detail her hair is fantastic it is really abundant on her hair it's not only a one piece but it's got little lashes coming out everywhere they are movable a little bit but they are kind of stiff so make sure not to break them they seem like they would easily break if you push it push on them too hard it's really awesome blue color and then with some white shading all around it looks really awesome she's got some ribbons holding on her hair really great this figure is by good smell company so it's gonna have an awesome sculpt and awesome paint job the face looks really cute no floss at all she's got the open mouth you can even see the tongue and the nose sculpt everything's sculpted perfectly on the face then of course she's on the cheerleading outfit here we have this i forget what they're called but they're they are sculpted like each of them separately you can move them around a lot it will break if you push on them too hard same as the hair they're not all the same color so some of them are, are a little lighter yellow and others are a darker yellow Which makes it look way better honestly in both her arms they're the same then her outfit is this glossy white kind of sleeves and then her her shirt looks fantastic also it's a little transparent in here in the middle and then and then the same glossy white as her sleeves on on the rest with a orange outline she also has the pink tie which is floating in the air you know because the pose is really dynamic it says she's jumping of course the tie is floating up in the air from behind it's easier to see there are the earbuds are attached from a thing from behind right here. She also has kind of a hood around the neck part. And then of course the skirt. You now it's all floating in the air, really good dynamic pose. And a really awesome sculpt too. And then for the feet, she's got this little knee coverings. I'm not sure what they're called, but they are also glossy. A lot of the figure is glossy looking, like her, her whole outfit, her shirt, and these things right here, and her sleeves. The skirt is not glossy, really nice matte color, but the glossy parts don't look too bad. They're even a little shaded all over too. On the pink side, here's where you're gonna put her the metal rod so she stays on the base. Now her boots are really, really good. I really like them. I really like the color and the design on them. We got this high heel and the heart design in here really awesome shading with the yellow and orange makes it look fantastic and then back here we got some more details same on the other side of the boot and then for the other boot the boots just look fantastic they're the same on both sides but really awesome sculpt and design on them this figure in general looks really good the hair of course makes it stand out a little more since she's got so much of it makes the figure look a lot more bigger and now to put her on the base let's actually put this in here just goes on like that and then i'm sure you just you just slide this like that and that's how she looks when she is on the base like i said this pose is really awesome like she's jumping in the air and the speaker bases are really really original not a boring base at all which i like on the fi on figures having awesome bases that have to do with the figure that also look great and that make the figure too she does seem to move around a little bit like if i move the base it kind of feels like she's gonna fall off but i don't think she will but just be careful about that Overall, this is a really amazing figure. Good Smell Company really delivered on this one. She looks awesome. Everything about it is perfect. I have no complaints. Maybe the glossy parts could have been done a little better. I think it looks fine on the outfit, but everything else looks fantastic. Comes in a really great and unique base and the rest of the figure. Awesome dynamic pose and her expression really well sculpted. The face and the paintwork all around is 
phenomenal. I'm really glad I got it. Let me know what you guys think of the figure. Make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one.